yeah i'm just trying to have a decent intro right now but everything that can be going wrong right now is going wrong do you hear the noise in the background the bike wow and there are like two or three different sound systems happening at the same time right now great then i don't know what's happening with my lighting right now and then i'm having a breakout i just this this is going nice welcome back to my channel guys <laughs> Today we're actually going to review two products, right? Um, it's a, one of them is a protein treatment, and the other is just a regular conditioner. Um, yes, yeah, so I'm gonna review two products. I'm gonna show you my outfit for my friend's wedding. I bought it on Sheen and had to go get it adjusted. You see that later on in the video. Um, what else am i i feel like i had something else to say and we're gonna figure out our hair stand together because i still haven't figured it out um, um so i went to the salon this week to go get my tips colored again because i had cut them i had colored tips but the last time it was really on the end ends this time is a bit more yeah and um yeah, it desperately needs a protein treatment and a moisture treatment. But uh, again, you go to the hair store and you can't find the products that you want to find. So you have to settle for something else. So I was very hesitant about the, the deep conditioners. So I just decided to go with a regular conditioner. But one that they say protein treatment goes well with a moisture treatment afterwards learn that kids anyways whoa that was corny <laughs> anyways um so yeah we're gonna do that today now the protein treatment the one that i got is a bit new to me not the brand it's a bit new to me because i bought another protein treatment in that line but they didn't have that and they told me to use this one this was the one that I had tried before. Hyper pack. Can you see that? Extremely damaged hair repair. Intense protein treatment. And it did a decent job, to be honest. Not my favorite, but it does a good job. Now they had another one, but the difference between the two is that this has in carotene. Carotene protein. So yeah, comes in this color bottle yeah and the other one i have used this line um i've used this brand cream of nature everybody knows that but this is their honey line and this will be my first time actually using their conditioner so here it is guys pure honey moisturizing dry defense conditioner now what i will do is put a link in my description like amazon links so that you know what it is and you, you, but you can find them in local beauty supply stores so yeah those are the two th products that i'll be reviewing today um i'm gonna use but the well i still didn't learn the name alafia shampoo <laughs> um to wash my hair but let me show you what's happening the hair right now it, as i said it looks really dry so let me show you what that's looking like so here we are yeah as i said my hair is dry but this is how the color looks right now right it kind of looks dull i'm a bit concerned <laughs> to be honest because as i said this is the really dry this is really dry. This looks like you wanna go cut, 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 cut. So, I am gonna do what needs to be done. 
and we're gonna try and save this <laughs> we're gonna try and save this right now because yeah so i'm gonna go shampoo my hair and come right back and we're gonna try this protein treatment together this is the madness that's happening right now <laughs> okay so now we're gonna go in with the protein treatment and then we're gonna go under the dryer now as you see from my last video i usually part my hair in four um freestyle way by the way before i even show you the process <laughs> let's see what this product is giving let's see so this is pretty thin okay that didn't happen with the last product Wow, this smells really good. And onto my hair like nothing. Wow. When I say that, I mean it went on pretty easily. I'm shocked. Wow, especially at the end. What's what's happening there? I don't feel like shampoo. the ends especially like the ends feel like <laughs> shampoo is on it yeah right let me do the other sections First thing first, I did research what is keratin. It's something good, especially when you want to straighten your hair, meaning like blow dry or flat iron it or something like that. It really helps with that. Um, as for the protein treatment itself, it was nice. I mean, from I put it on, I, I felt the difference. A protein treatment is really supposed to bring back life to your hair after it has gone through some chemical processing um or heat or whatever like that you're supposed to use protein treatment it is recommended every six weeks there about so i would say about four to six weeks and then for your deep conditioning you're advised to do it at least every two weeks for me sometimes i do it every week depending on the state of my hair um there was a point where i literally got rid of regular conditioners for my hair because they weren't doing a thing i just stuck with um deep conditioners but then i started using actually products and i was able to use more regular conditioners and stuff like that um because the other deep conditioners weren't really doing anything i really need to explore more into products but the ones that i were that i was using sorry they weren't really doing much for me um like in the moment yeah great then like a few days later you're like sometimes even the day after you're like did i put something in my hair at all <laughs> like it's crazy now what i really did not like about this product as you can see i took off the top i took off the top um because that little thing coming out and it takes forever to come out i just took it off and, and you saw the bulk come out yeah so next on the agenda so i did not get a deep conditioner but i got a regular conditioner it's a moisturizing dry defense conditioner that's what they said honey that's what they said so what are we gonna do i'm gonna try it out um so i'm gonna wash out the protein treatment and then apply this i didn't show you how it look after the protein treatment so let me pull out all the twists yeah this is how it looks after the protein treatment yeah this one okay so i just finished conditioning my hair and i'm gonna give you my honest review on this product okay so first things first that's a very thick texture there it is yeah um as for the conditioner itself it's a great conditioner 
but I just wouldn't use it again for myself and tell you the reasons why and then you decide if you want to use it yes or no I have thick hair <laughs> and I I have a serious issue with dryness right I literally almost used the entire bottle I kid you not and this is a 12 fluid ounce bottle it's almost done people like quarter of it is left in there yeah I I wouldn't use it again so if you know that you deal with dryness and you have really thick hair like I do go get this this is really a great conditioner but money wise for me nah nah it would work for me so yeah that's my take on that back to the pro all right so I have washed out the conditioner and I have already put in leave-in conditioner I put in hair butter cream and I also put in castor oil if I can get the video here I'll show you because I didn't see a photo per se so right here the video would kind of play so that you see see it not the process just see the hairstyle so we're gonna attempt it all right so the first step is done it's just to do a middle part and then part it like this it's a small section really you're gonna put two flat twists on this side and two flat twists on this side yeah so this lighting thing really isn't working out for me just to let you know, I put a flat twist here and a flat twist here and I joined them with rubber bands like she did so that they can go up like this. And I have my two antennas right here. All right, so for the back, I'm just gonna put water in it again. Water is your best friend, guys. Water is your best friend. Just gonna put water to dampen it some more again and then put gel just put gel in it put it up in what not sure how i feel about this hairstyle right now might spray it might take it tomorrow and, and it won't be the same i'll just change it um it obviously is different from the girl's mold if she has curls i have coils right um, I'm not really feeling it right now, but I need to wait for it to um, dry and shrink up. And right now it's kind of fizzy because I keep handling it. But let's see tomorrow. Alrighty, so I'm home from the wedding. I did not wear the dress that I said I was going to wear. I wore something that was um, in my closet. Did I get to take any pictures? No. Yeah, I was just living in the moment, so I didn't take any pictures. I apologize for that. And rain started falling before I even left the house. So yeah, um, I don't know if I can let you get to see the outfit. Uh, but yeah, I ended up sticking to the original hairstyle. It fit this outfit. And the reason why I was really feeling it, because if I wore it with the dress, I would look cute. I had a little cute girl, you know, um, going to prep school and thing. I feel like the dress has its place and there are hairstyles, different hairstyles that can make it more mature. Maybe like using some sort of hair extension like braids or you just put on a ponytail or something. So that was my thought on that dress. <sighs> I was really depressed, but I got it done and <laughs> I feel better now. It's not too big on makeup. I'm not a makeup artist and I'm not about to let any makeup artist discriminate me or anything. Thanks. Thanks. I just put on something to lift me a bit. Thank you very much. Sorry. And then that's um, it for this video. Thanks for watching again, guys. Bye.